So yeah, with regards to meeting rooms, uh, the way they are currently, we we definitely see a change in in that aspect because obviously, um, you know, where you might have something like a twelve person meeting space, you're not going to get twelve people in there right now. It's uh, it's going to be maybe a six person room or less. Uh, and also, you know, people are thinking about what their um, spaces are going to be doing uh, as people come back to work. Are they actually going to be used for meeting spaces or actually are they going to have to be forced into maybe hot desking and stuff like that in those spaces? So actually probably foresee um, multifunctional spaces, if nothing else, uh, flexible spaces. That's probably the key thing. Uh, and certainly, you know, it's not a big concern of ours because we know that our technology will probably help with those transitions. Uh, and we'd like to think at some point, you know, meeting rooms will come back and and do what they need to be doing more frequently. But I think with the fact that there are going to be a lot more people hot desking and uh, going in and out of the offices, uh, I think it's definitely going to be an onus on flexible spaces. We've got a mixture of people within Sennheiser. And so this space is not just used by the sales team. This is not a dedicated demonstration space. It is a functional multi-purpose space. So the furniture is always moving around and that partition wall behind me is always coming across opening and closing. So people are doing different things on both sides of the rooms, having those flexible style of meetings, whether they lay the furniture out accordingly. But what we've been able to utilize is obviously our ceiling microphone, which is absolutely designed for that flexible working. Uh, so people don't have to think about what the technology is doing. They can just move into the space, use the space as they want, with the assurance that the audio is gonna come through crystal clear. During lockdown, we were able to do online calls where people can join our seminars and listen to the quality of the mic on the far end. But this new feature that was launched pretty much two months ago, um, has to be heard in the per in person because it is called a true voice lift uh, um, feature. And what that does, it not only already allows the microphone to be used for high quality audio calls for far end use, but if you're in that bigger type of environment where you need that little bit of voice amplification in the room, you can still use the same microphone. Previous to this update, you could do it before, but you had to be more careful about which speakers you use, where you place them in relation to where the microphone is, and then how much gain you actually get. With this new feature, it almost gives you uh, a protection bag, if you like, and uh, a safety blanket to be able to do this far more effectively. So you can actually get speakers a lot more closer, or you can use more speakers. Um, and it doesn't really matter what type of dispersion pattern those speakers have got, because now you've got that added benefit with this new algorithm of being able to get a lot more gain before feedback with some real clever stuff that we're doing in the microphone. Yeah, so the exclusion zones that we use uh, allow to um, aid with that uh, voice lift element, but actually the exclusion zones predominantly allow you to get rid of any other background noise that you don't want. Things like HVAC noises or high level projector noises uh, and things like that coming off the ceiling. Or you can pinpoint exclusion zones to maybe wall mounted speakers or even noisy doorways. And that all helps towards a, a great audio experience for the far end as well as the in-room participant. Audio has always played second fiddle. Um, but now the fact that more and more people have been forced to use good audio on calls, they definitely identify poor audio experience a lot quicker than they probably used to. So I think now we're definitely seeing an appreciation for good audio. And that means as people come back into the offices, we want them to bring that passion and that experience into their uh, work lives and demand good audio again. So we'd like to really think that we are in a really good place, uh, especially with all these new features on our ceiling mic, for instance, that we can emphasize in a lot of different industries the, the benefits of bringing good audio back to uh, what people should be getting in, in the meeting experience.